Call me Cotton Candy. Cotton Candy? Cotton Candy sweet as gold. Let me see that. Okay. <laughs> we not gonna do that. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm your girl, Miss Christy Christina with a K. Hey, 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 hey girl, hey boy, how you doing? How you feeling? We haven't seen you in like forever. Woo! You we haven't. Up my video. Don't be bitter. Do not be bitter. You know, you know, you dark wigs. I'm not gonna be dark. bitter because I know, I know the dark Come on wigs now. always bitter. You don't always have to sit there trying to be in dark. I just figured I add a little bit of color, and excitement to the intro. <laughs> you are vibrant. Okay. We got two wigs. In this oh, okay, video. okay, two wigs. We're showing two weeks today. I haven't done this in a while. <laughs> okay, I like it. You I know, know it's been a while. Weeks, we so haven't I mean, done an intro, intro like this in like forever. Now. Right, right. <laughs> hey, y'all. <laughs> we know, we know the color they wanted to see on your stock card is my color. <laughs> y'all gonna see me at the end. Well, actually in the middle. But um, I'm gonna let her finish. Okay, all right. So we will okay, see you at the bye. end. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know I haven't done an intro like that in a while. So I'll be talking about Miss Reagan. This is the color on the stock card right here, Miss Reagan. But I got a natural color. You'll see it in this one in the rosemary color. I'm really hyped y'all because this wig is beautiful. It's gorgeous. Today we are doing two wigs in this video. It's two different wigs. They came out about the same time and initially when I saw this wig, I wanted to do that color that you guys just saw because it was on this stock card initially when I saw it. You know, but I was like, let's do a natural color too because they want to see how the natural colors are hitting too. But yeah, the wig got me feeling by sheer coincidence. Really good. Okay. Family just came home. Oh, that's so sweet, y'all. Like, this is really sweet. This is really, and it's pretty too. Okay, I'm back to the video. Back to the video. Focus, focus. The wig got me feeling good. Flower. You know, you gotta do stuff like that to make yourself feel good. Anyway, I'm gonna just show you guys basically how I install this wig, and then I'm gonna show you the other wig, and then I'm gonna wrap it up in my final thoughts. Before we get started, give this video a thumbs up for me. Hit that subscribe button. Boop right there. Let's go ahead and jump into it.
finished installing this wig, what a day. I filmed so much today when I say skincare, makeup, like we got a lot of videos coming up. So y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that because woo! So today we are talking about this Bobbi Boss glueless lace wig in the style Reagan. I have the color number two. Again, like I told you guys in the intro, I initially wanted this color, but it was sold out. But stay tuned. You're going to see this color in the other style that I have coming up. I'm going to go ahead and give you guys some specs. This is a 13 by 4 lace frontal. So you're only going to get lace right here in the middle. You can part it any way you like. I went ahead and just left it in the middle because I do have that other style coming up and it's to the side. So, you know, we don't need to show different options with that. This does come with an HD transparent lace. It says you can wear this wig glueless. It comes with baby hairs, pre-plucked, the length. This is the style here. It's a nice, really pretty style. It reminds me of Sensational Morgan, to be honest with you. It's this nice, pretty, kind of sleek, but layered look right here. You get these nice, big, juicy curls right here. And then it's really, really long. The back. It's a really long wig. Pros and some cons on this wig. I really do like the style of this wig. As far as cons go, it says it's a glueless wear wig. Initially, as you guys saw, I did try to use a, a wig grip just to kind of see. Bobby Boss wigs, I think at this point we kind of all know that Bobby Boss wigs are a little bit smaller than other wigs. So I wish they would have gave us a little bit more room. But I do notice if you kind of pull the wig from the back and pull it up, it stretches better versus just trying to pull it from the front. The wigs in the past haven't been coming all the way down. And it seems like it's kind of getting a little bit better, but it's still it's still a little short here. I wish it was a little bit more room. So Bobby Boss, thank you guys so much for working on that. But give us give us a little bit more room in front. It's not too tight where I feel like I'm getting a headache, but it is a little bit on the snug side. Baby hairs. I didn't use any baby hairs. I just went ahead and I used my hot comb and I pushed those baby hairs back. I did go in and pluck this wig. I have a whole video up by now. Check it out right here y'all. I'm gonna start referring y'all back to videos because I can't be doing this in every video and I know some people don't want to see it but if you want to see how I pluck a synthetic wig definitely check this video out right here. I'll leave it in the cards. So I did pluck this wig. It was a lot of plucking y'all. It says it's a pre-plucked hairline but I personally feel like you have to go in and pluck this wig if you want it to look a little bit more realistic and natural i think she's looking pretty good okay i did like the lace on this uh, i did go in a little bit differently i did go in with my kufani lace scent spray because i told y'all stuff at in the bottom of the closet we gotta use this stuff up okay we are in uh inflation right now so we need to be using all of our products in our house i have this lace scent spray in the color mocha so i just sprayed kind of right back here just to kind of tint it a little bit and then i went in with my powder in the front i put on my makeup after I feel like that works better for me I did also go in and secure this wig with this Evan New York gold adhesive spray it's in the sensitive one I've been using this quite a bit now and I think I really really do like it this compared to the black can the black can is like shoop it'll secure that wig real tight it'll it'll do it real real quick real tight real easy but my issue with that is that it was a little bit too tight and i felt like my edges used to pull out with that so this one i noticed it's a little bit more tackier and it takes a while to dry so i don't know the formula of this one i feel like it's not as snatched <laughs> if that makes any sense but it is a good hold like look at that wig that wig is not coming off i am getting a lot of tangling with this wig i did have to go on my synthetic wig spray y'all know me i use my synthetic wig spray mixed with a little bit of serum and because i've been working with this wig like all day i mean like hours i did have to keep going in and spraying this wig I'm not going to be walking in the streets with synthetic wig spray and serum. So that's kind of a con for me. But I do like the texture of this wig. It's just that that's it's a synthetic wig and it's long. It's super long. So it's definitely going to tangle. Is the synthetic wig spray and the serum going to make it not tangle all day? No! It's just going to help a little bit with maintenance of the wig. But I feel like this length is just a little bit too long. And it probably needs to be cut a little bit. Probably like right here. And it will work a little bit better versus all of this extra length. It's just a little bit too long for me. But this is a, a beautiful glam photo shoot wig if this is what you're looking for. Because she's cute. Let's go ahead and jump into the other color and wrap this video up, y'all. We getting, we, we need to wrap this up. Wrap this up. All right, guys. So this is the other color. Oh, this wig got me feeling spicy. <laughs> 
this is the other wig. This is the Bobby Boss Glueless JL wig. And yes, you just saw Reagan, but you saw her in a natural color. But this is the color on Reagan's stock card that I have in JL. So uh, let's talk about her. This color, this color, let's talk about this color, this TT Rosemary color. I've been seeing this color float around and I was like, I absolutely have to try it. I think this is the beauty. Hold on, hold on. We need some more gloss on our lips. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Had to put more gloss on. <laughs> so I think this is the beauty of this wig and synthetic wigs in general. You get to try color. You get to experiment with color. And we cannot lie, this baby pink going into this burgundy color is so pretty you got some blonde in here mixed with the baby pink and then it goes into this dipped rosemary color and this is more red but then at the end it's darker so it's, it's beautiful y'all initially i was very intimidated but i think like i said this is the beauty of trying synthetic wigs this wig ranges about 38 to 45 dollar range depending on your site so i did have to hurry up and get this wig because this color is sold out but i mean i might not be keeping her <laughs> Y'all know I do wig sales. Check the description box, but she's very pretty. Same exact specs. This one is a 13 by four lace frontal, just like JL. And I also do apologize for all that noise that you guys heard in the previous clip. And you're gonna hear it again in the next clip with the dark wig because my husband was grilling. He was doing a lot, but the house is quiet. The house is really quiet right now. Nobody's home. Nobody is home. <laughs> So I'm trying to hurry up and film this video. So sorry about that. But either way, I do like this one. This one is going to come with a lot more curls in this one. That other one is a little bit more sleek and just those kind of loose curls. But this one is more for my girls that like more curls. She's super long, y'all. Like she's absolutely long. This is how long the wig is coming. And in the back... She's coming all the way down to my butt. I did go ahead and put this wig to the side just to kind of give you guys a different styling option. The 13 by 4 kind of stops right here so you can't part it too much. I did go in and I plucked this wig. Even though this is a colored wig, I feel like it just looks a little bit more realistic when it's plucked. Check out my video right here if you need to know how to pluck a synthetic wig. I, I, I got videos. We got videos. I went in with my foundation underneath the lace. I tried to get it to look as much like scalp as possible. The pros of this wig is pretty much the color and the style. The style is really pretty and it's it's very affordable but the con for me and also reagan because i actually did wear that wig a couple days because i'm filming this stuff like separate days and i could give you guys a more thorough report i did get a lot of shedding with that other wig and i'm getting a lot of shedding with this one as well it's not as bad but i am getting shedding i do want to mention that and also because of this color this wig is very dry y'all like this wig is super dry <laughs> She's very dry. Like you can see, she's already starting to get a little ratty on me. But Bobby Boss is usually really good with the fibers. But I just feel like maybe because of the color blend that they use for this specific color, that's why it's a little bit more dry. I don't know. I can't speak on the other colors because the other one didn't feel so dry, the natural color. I mean, but that's kind of ha what happens when you start messing in color with synthetic wigs. So keep that in mind. So I do recommend that you go in with some synthetic wig spray. I actually had to go in with some water, some serum. Like I had to go ahead and juice her up. We had to condition this wig. Overall, I do like this wig. If you're looking for that celebrity kind of colored look, I totally feel like a million bucks without a million bucks. Like this is a good picture wig. It's a good photo shoot wig or out wig I probably if I would keep it I would cut her a little bit more because this part right here is a little bit too long for me just with these synthetic wigs it just starts getting all matted and stuff at the end like that and that's what I don't like but right here is pretty much like a good length for this wig in my opinion also the last thing is I did go in with this wig a little bit different I did use my black can Ebony New York um lace spray in the other wig I did install that one with the gold can and I do like it but like I said it takes a little bit longer to dry the hold is a little different it's not as tight like this one look this wig is not coming off like this wig is secure for days so i mean if you want a stronger hold this is the strongest out of all the lace sprays that i use but i usually like to take my wigs off at night and i don't like the way my edges feel sometimes personal preference with using this black spray so it just depends on what kind of melt i'm trying to get you know if that makes sense but um who's looking like a strawberry shortcake <laughs> okay man call me cotton cotton candy cotton 
fucking Kansas sweet as gold. Let me see that. Okay. <laughs> we not gonna do that. <laughs> She's pretty. She works. Let's go ahead and wrap this video up. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the black wig again. Y'all let me know if y'all like this two wig video thing too. Also, drop me some comments, drop me some comments. I'm gonna talk to y'all at that. Okay, so that wraps up our video. Y'all let me know which color was your favorite, which style was your favorite. Are you more of the sleek look or do you like more of the curly? side part which one are you i think they're both good if one of them is sold out if it's a link for my amazon storefront i'll leave a link below i do earn a small commission if you guys shop my affiliate links it does help me out it helps me reinvest into the channel so i'll definitely leave a link below if there's a link provided it's a 35 dollar wig y'all i mean what else can you expect y'all give this video a thumbs up for me hit that subscribe button and until next time i'm gonna talk to y'all later bye one time.